Hey everyone, I'm Alfred. Welcome back to Monster Train. So I don't like this guy. This is a this is a significant problem that I actually oh yeah. Why don't we take those down, huh? Um, this is a significant problem that I actually have with um roguelikes and card games for that matter. I hate playing as little little guys. I like playing as huge cool guys. Uh. Like, I legitimately don't enjoy playing as little weird guys. Um, and so I don't like playing with the Stygian because, like, I just don't appreciate their guy. Um. <laughs> oh, wow. They mark out for every single. Yeah, wow. That's super cool. We're gonna give Umbra a shot, um, because all we need to do is just kill enough to, to see the next part. Um, let's do, uh, a Hellhorned. I know that we've played around as Hellhorned, but... Also... Fell... Okay. So, what does this guy do? He has really good attack. He gives you more room on the floor. Trampled. When attacking, excess damage is transferred to the next guy. Ooh, that's real nice. Oh. Well, sure. Give us more room anyway. We'll take more damage for more cash. Okay. So these guys use these things. Morsels. Cast it. It drops something in your hand. What that is? I don't know. It's like almost loosely random what it is. Um, you just know that it'll be a morsel. And dudes eat those. So you can see he literally ate that thing. So we can, hmm. Yeah, that's unfortunate. But we can put it up here. Yeah, that's not good. Okay, so now one of them will survive. Yeah, you don't have much chance, I'm sorry. Okay, we're taking five. Oops. All right, we'll put them here, and then we'll just, I guess we'll just do that. Give him the opportunity. Yeah, so you can buff guys up when they eat the morsels. Uh, so yeah, um, it's kind of weird. Because uh, the whole deck is... Uh, Kinda based on war. I assume it's not like, you know, literally based on it. Like they didn't have it going in mind, but like it's just a little uncomfortable to look at sometimes. Alright, let's go magic and get another Umbra. Okay. That's it. Okay, bye. Morsel Maker. Useful. Or Morsel Master. God. I totally didn't even know. Spikes, let's not even risk it. <laughs> okay. So, Penumbra. And then Morsel Master. No, not Morsel Master then. Okay. So here's what we'll do. 
Morsel Master duplicates guys that go onto his floor with him. But he's just taking up a whole bunch of space here. So yeah, he goes through guys and kills very efficiently. Okay. But we can put this one here. Cool. Okay. Cool. So you can see, he just keeps eating up here. Which is, of course, very useful. And because these guys, some of the morsels, are giving us more stuff. Some of them are giving us more, like, um... How do I put this? They're giving us more energy, right. That's what it's called. Wow. That was quite the that was quite a rush down. More armor. Fine with me. Duplicate artifact. We're not missing that much pyre, so we'll go ahead and go this way. I like the Morsel Master, honestly. This Warden. Gorging is a thing that I believe lets you just get more juice um, out of eating a guy. Historian approaches the back door, the open door with large books in the back of his carriage. My time in Hell's granted me access to the records of so many fascinating clans. The pages lost their value, but I've memorized their con as I've memorized their contents. I have all these with me. One horn. Fragile and multi-strike to a unit. Quick. Quick is pretty good. Good luck, Hellborn. Okay. Daedalus the Professor. On to the first boss. Okay. So this game's pretty noisy. I hope that the last few episodes have been good. i just so excited to record it. Okay. Let's try you on this floor, then. Let's have guys take hit. All right. Okay. Morsel maker. Morsel master. Let's let them fight. Okay, cool. Oh, beautiful. Oh, and it duplicates all of them. Crucible Warden. Gorge. Trigger. Okay, so they have a thing that procs whenever they eat. You're going to be quick. Oh, look at that. And then all of it goes on to him. <laughs> oh, man. This is great. This is pretty good. All right, Rage 3. So Rage 3 gives us juice, but... Cool. And then these are just... We're just going to lose. Ember Draining is an effect that uh, takes away our, our the stuff we cast with. Why are they skipping this room? Am I blind? Is there something about it? Haste. They have haste up. Do these guys have haste? They do. And so does he. How do we get rid of that? Oh, it's you. You're giving them haste. 
Conduit Infiltrator. Loud and clear. Okay. Just gotta not be stupid when it comes to that. Okay. Do you have haste up? No, just relentless. All right, let's watch the fight then. Wow. Non-stop munching and crunching. They didn't even get to the second floor. Hot damn. That's pretty great, all right. Let's put you on. Horned warrior just for the variety. Uh, Light of Seraph. Okay. I'm kind of liking this deck. Let's get shit out of my deck. These are so worthless. Okay. Really, guys? Okay, that's better. Now we can hold off and wait. All right. Come on. Ooh. Now that's looking nice. Railbeater. Strike. Apply melee weakness. That's pretty great. Alright. Trample. He already has trample, though. Or lifesteal and gorge. Mark of Invasion will take, even though we don't have jack strips. Morsels coming in. Okay. Zero damage, six damage, one damage. And they're hasted. Okay. We need to get rid of you so you walk through the rest of this actual thing, damn you. Alright, Gorge gives him damage shield, and when he eats this one, he'll get damage shield. So he can get two procs of damage shield on that. Okay. Also, this is a minor thing, but I love how this game is like, Hey, do you want to know what music you're listening to? Knock yourself out, fam. Hmm. Okay. As long as the boss doesn't skip. Oh, more stuff. I like those. Yeah, the fact that they're skipping the middle floor, but that's where all my goodies are, like, oh, man. I wonder if they plan for that. Like, the fact that this only does the middle floor is because there are people who can skip the middle floor. Let's give that a shot. Morsel. Another one down. All right. You gotta go. Great. Exactly what I wanted.
All right, let's see about it. Okay, damage shields are holding. Wow. All right. 19 damage taken, though. Not good at all. I think it caps at 50. That's good. Branding right. 5 damage, 20 armor. Fine by me. All right. We are now missing 20 health. Trinkets, though. Versus forging, getting stuff out of the deck. Can you summon an imp? Jack strips. Rage doesn't decay. Wow. While we're here, why don't we just get rid of one of you? Just because it's cheap. We could do another one, but I'll save it. Get plus three to their X. Oh! Hello. That is good. Spell shield. Okay, we can do spell shield. It's called Ancient Hate. I wonder what the lore of that is. All right. They are stealthed. All right. We will just hold on to this until we can cast it. Which should be soon by the looks. Morsel Master. And let's put another one in here. So it's letting us do one more just because... All right, get the money. Damn. All right, big munching, big chomps. Let's put this on, and we're not going to decrease every turn, right? Yeah. I like that. I'm starting to like this deck more. I had it as my side deck instead of my main deck. Um, and I really didn't like it. But now that I'm doing it like this, it's pretty cool. Okay. Thirty-six. With everything. Plus three, and then all of the extra stuff we had. Yeah, that's good. Oh, we're letting the guys upstairs slack, though. Yeah, we're down ten. Ten isn't bad, though. Yeah, let's just get more of those. Oh, look at that damage. Good lord. Let's let's have you go first, huh? Oh, the damage. Well, they're all dead. Oh, he only got to go once. That's super unfortunate. Okay. More of that. More of that. Stand up here and take hits. Spell shield. Spell shield. Okay, so she's going to do one and then two. Okay. Less good, but... I did kind of expect this. The melee weakness is helping at least. Oh, 
Ugh. It's so shameful to have the spire handle it. So yeah, caps at 50%. So if you lose like 25 or more, I think that just means you're not going to take any more. So that's all right, I guess. Apply damage shield, add three morsels. Okay, cool. Chomper. More health. Or more, uh, more whatever this is. Okay, we could duplicate. We can forge some stuff. We're getting some interesting spells now, so we can give that a shot. Familiar crystals. Major refraction. Four. Hoy. But then we have that. Let's do one of these guys just because they're ranked, they're only one. There's now a behemoth. The train lurches under the creature's new weight. Terrifying. Alright, magic. Give that a shot. Just keep doing quick. Alright, reliable, nice, morsel miner. 25 damage. Okay. God, whatever. Where did we get to? We got to six. Is that longer than we went? We've been recording for about the same. Fell. I think Fell has killed me more than most of the other bosses. Yeah, because she makes these, just these huge tanks. Two? Man, that's not cool. Five damage, huh? All right. You're going in. And then you're going in here. And so are you. And then we're going to toughen you up just so you take less. Yep. Okay. Getting rid of this. Putting a morsel miner in. Let's do some rage. Okay. I like that the morsels take hits for me. I think that's cool and fun. Okay. Oh. Five and three. Hmm. We're not going to be able to kill them anyway, so we could just do that and then take that damage, painful as it is. Okay. We're down to 25, and I've got to say, that's pretty embarrassing. We'll just get rid of those. Alright, thank you guys. A few little morsels. Okay. That'll help. We can get these out of here now, essentially for free. Alright. Gain that. 32. We'll lose a. Ah, oh, let's do it. Oh, beautiful. The damage isn't terrible. We're just taking a lot of pyre health damage. 
damage, and that's less cool. Okay. We can't do anything here anyway. Okay. Big chomp. Those guys all get stronger. Not bad, not bad. Oh, that's agonizing. I've never had my pyre killed due to just like card damage. All right, let's give it a shot. They're going all up. Okay. Anything else that we can we can put you here? Demtro, damage shield one at three uncommon or rare morsels. I like that. All right, and then. Oh, we're full. Damn. Ooh. We snuck that one in. We took a lot of damage, though. That was really lame on my part. Dark deal. I like it. Uh, hmm. I haven't been suffering too bad for this, but maybe it'd be smart. Okay. Artifact. Let's go for it. When you play the 20th morsel unit, deal a Oh, wow. So is that when you play it or when it is just there? Because if a morsel is, is created by someone else, I don't know if it counts or not. Endless. Yeah, we're gonna get another one of you. So if you die, we just keep bringing you back. You're gonna be mad as hell and you're not gonna take it anymore. And we're gonna make somebody more survivable. I could have done it to that guy actually. Just sacked him off and let him take take more on. Um, we'll save it because we won't be able to get enough. Trample, lifesteal, um, just more health or better gorge and health. The gorge is working for him, so let's get more of that. Okay, this is a normal battle, so maybe it'll be okay. Might be okay. Who knows? <laughs> Do you? I don't. 20 armor, I'll take it. It's easy. Okay. An ombra. 25 will kill him in one. Let's put you out front. And then you're gonna just get real mad. All right, thank you for taking the damage. All I ever wanted. Quick. We need to be quick. Should have read more. You might be right when you say that my pyre has burned its last. Okay. Is there even enough health in this to take all that? Hell no, there's not. Well, that's unfortunate. 
Um, I like this deck. It relies so much more on minions, though, because you're getting this little, you know, nothing minions and... Haven to send everyone on the floor. I start a turn. Ooh. Cardless applied. Funny. Um, wow. So, oh yeah, we get, this is really cool, but I really like this extremely in-depth summary. I like that. Uh, but yeah, it's really hard. The game is satisfactory in its difficulty. You know what I mean? Because um, I talked about how like Slay the Spire is just... Oh, I feel like it's a little too hard to start. Um, you know? And there's a couple other problems with Slay the, the with Slay the Spire that I've of course talked about in the past. But like, man, I like this game. It's cool. I really enjoy it. Um... When I unlock the next guys, because I've only been playing for like five hours, but when I unlock the next guys, I'm going to do a run as them, and then uh, maybe I'll get the DLC. I kind of hate DLC. Um, most DLC in the modern day is handled in a sort of predatory manner. Um, re okay, this is on my mind. Paradox just upped the price of all their Crusader Kings 3 DLC because they're like, we feel like we uh, deserve more. So now old DLC will cost another $5 if you didn't already own it. And the new DLC is going to cost like 10 bucks or whatever instead of just paying 5 And like, those are all things that should have been in the game to start, don't you think? It's not like history is... It's not like more medieval history is being made. You know, we can, we can just have all of those things in there. Um... And I feel like it's very much just to give us more money move from Paradox, a company that is already really bad about pricing its DLC and making DLC for its games. But I digress. That's just a little DLC spiel that I didn't need to go on. Um, but yeah, I don't know if I'll do one with the uh, the other guys because I really don't like them. Uh, and I might do another one with um, the last guys when I unlock them. Maybe if the DLC goes on sale, uh, but this game is $25. Um, if I can just take a second of your time and, like, check here. Slay the Spire will run you... Oh my god, I played 130 hours of Slay the Spire. Slay the Spire will run you the same amount, but it does not have DLC. And the new character that came out was just added. It's not DLC. Um, now granted, there are more characters in this, but, I mean, I still don't know. I just don't like buying DLC. I don't abide by it. Um, but yeah, uh, that's been Monster Train. Very enjoyable game. Uh, if you like it, let the devs know. Buy it, or just tweet at them. Be like, hey, your game looks great. Um, I've been Alfred. I'll see you guys next time. I hope you have a good week. Bye.